Kumuhula competition. It's coming up to television this evening on K5. Kumuhula Hinale Muanawang Kalu, board member of the Kalihi Palama Culture and Art Society, joins us this morning to talk about it. Kumu, hi. Aloha kakaiaka. How are you? My kaino. Okay, so hula competition now. Actually, the competition's finished already, but we're finally able to see and all of the haumana and the kumu and the, basically everybody gets to watch the keiki hula competition. Absolutely. We are proud to bring our community three days of celebrating more hula, this time for the Keiki Hula Festival, uplifting the name of our beloved queen, Lili Uokalani. Whose birthday is today? Whose birthday is today? So, how many participate in an event like this? This year we had 10,000 participants, well, attendees, mm -hmm. and they attended not only the Soloist Night, Kahiko Night, Awana Night, and they also attended the Makeke, our vendors that came to bring all of the wonderful Hawaii made items. And this is the first time that you actually had it uh, right next door in the exhibition area during the yes. event, right? It made it very convenient for people to come and attend either or or both. Um, and thus, uh, yeah, we had a great turnout this year. Several sides to this. Uh, of course, from the Kalihi Palama point of view, why is this important? This is important because this is a legacy that was started by George Naope and Wendell Silva. And it was their dream that culture would be perpetuated in our community. And so as we look towards the 50th year in this coming year, um, we can appreciate just how important this legacy is by looking at many of our merry monarch kumu, um, whom also have connection to Keiki Hula. On a more general, as a kumu, why is this important to be part of uh, what we do, a big event like this, and also to show it on television? It's important for us, not only as Kumu, but as community, to stop and make sure that we do all that we can to uplift the voices through our mele, our mele hula, mele oli, mele himeni, and that we ensure that Hawaii is alive with our culture because without Kanaka and without that which makes us a Hawaiian place, what would Hawaii be? Mm. Uh, speaking of the many voices, we hope that you're feeling better because we know allergies are, are with you this morning. Thank you. Um, we want to mention that if you want more information on the Kiki Hula competition, it starts tonight, tomorrow, and Wednesday, 6 p.m. on K5 television. And if you want more information, we'll put that uh, the website at the bottom of your screen, but also we'll have this interview uh, coming up uh, for you. Is, do you like... Uh, Kahiko night, Awana night, or soloist night? Is there one that you like? Oh, I just appreciate seeing our young people do their thing, and every night is a favorite night for me. Okay. We hope that every night is a favorite night for you, too. We'll have you uh, watch on K5. We'll go ahead and take a break. You're watching K uh, Hawaii News Now, Sunrise.